dueling? I myself am a fan also. After all, who doesn't aspire to be a master? I'd be very interested in seeing your... Expulsor! Inflatus! A pugno! Incarcerate! What do you want? Now you're in trouble. The witch mm. is in Expulsor! Inflatus! No. False. Megalith. The witch snowballs. I'll get you for this. Atlas Whisper. In Carter. Expulso. In Flightus. A pug no. Incarcerate. Expulso. Incendio. The witch snowball. Fantastic bomb. Centaur. You want him? Don't even fall. Ash one. At the mantle of feather. Pokemon. Now you're in trouble. Fantastic bomb. Hitler. Ash one. 
Fantastic bomb. Nifla. Nifla. No. Listen to you. Now you're in trouble. Now you. Now you all get you. Get you for this. Now you keep going. You've got me out. I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, oh, boy. Sorry. I tried my best. Excuse me. Oh. Oh. Good timing. I need to run some errands, but I don't want to leave Fang alone. He's uh, not been acting himself, you see. Would you mind watching him till I... Of course not, Hagrid. You go. I'll see if I can't get him to calm down. Thanks. I'll be back as soon as I can. What's the matter, Fang? Are you not feeling well? Perhaps some gentle, soothing strokes will help calm you down. That was close. Not Fang's never been aggressive towards me, or anyone else. Something must be bothering him. Perhaps, if I look around, 
I can find. There are brightly colored pink feathers over here. What bird could have shed these? Those are the bloopers from yesterday's Care of Magical Creatures class. If I remember correctly, their song can cause insanity. That's why you've been acting so odd, isn't it, Fang? I better take care of them before I fall under their song's effects, too. of Disney. Uh -huh. You all right? Yeah, I think so. But I think poor Fang's been affected. Ah, nothing a few days rest won't fix. I'm just relieved you're... I got halfway to Hogsmeade when I realized I forgot to reapply the silencing... Silencing charm? Is that to prevent the Fwoopers from driving anyone insane with their song? That's right. It has to be cast monthly or... Well, you get this. That's normally I'm more on top of it than this. But I've been so busy with a project of mine that I plumb forgot. Sorry. I should have recognized Fang's symptoms soon. It's all right, Hagrid. No harm done. Yeah, thanks to you. If you hadn't stopped these floopers, all of Hogwarts could have ended up like Fang and I are mighty grateful that you cleaned up after us. <laughs>
Someone is waiting up ahead. I don't know who it is. Wicked wizard! There's something big and black curled up on the forest floor in the next clearing. like the plants up ahead are thriving. That should be an excellent place for gathering what I need. There seems to be a huge figure up ahead. Something just slithered past my foot and into the clearing up ahead. Something just slithered past my foot and into the clearing of it. Two tall figures stand up ahead. It sounds like footsteps and boxes driving ahead. Could someone else be here? Ah, oh, this web is huge. Almost to fit the past.
Morning. Ready for another adventure? I was hoping to eat breakfast first. Eat fast. Gossamer said he'd show us a secret passage to the school kitchens this morning. Keep it up and you'll become Filch's VIP. Relax, Daniel. It's not like we'll be doing anything bad. Just searching for some more fun places. Oh, look! Post arrived! My first copy of the Daily Prophet. Now we can keep up with current events. And the latest Quidditch standings, of course. And the... Hey! <laughs> hey, Colby. Looks like someone fancies himself a cultured sort. Reads the Daily Prophet, he does. That's mine. Give it back, Rock. Or... <laughs> oh, what? You'll curse us? Do you even know how to use that wand? Him? Maybe not. But we know how to use ours. Fantastic bomb. Are you? Don't even fall. Just made an enemy for life, my friend. Yeah, that's right. In fact, you made two of them. Good. If you both hate me, I won't have to learn how to tell you apart, will I?
Thank you, everyone. You're welcome. Now, how about you read us some of those current events you mentioned before? Sure. Uh, here's something. The Ministry had to obliviate over 400 muggles after all the statues in Trafalgar Square hopped off the pedestals and danced a jig. No one's claimed responsibility, but it must have been not me. What? N-O-T-M-E. The Nocturnal Order of Tricks and Magical Exhibitions. They've taken credit for quite a few illegal displays like this. <laughs> it's quite the scandal. Apparently, the group's goal is to make magic known to all. All? As in everybody? Muggles included? Sounds like trouble if you ask me. Why? You don't think Muggles will accept magic when they see it? One at a time, maybe, but as a group, Muggles tend to be a bit hysterical, don't they? That's why we've got the, uh, um, what's it called, Kevin? The International Statute of Wizarding Secrecy. Right, that one. Now, if you'll excuse us, we've got our own secrets to uncover. Come on, Kevin. I don't know. Should we keep magic from muggles? What do you think, Daniel? Well, keeping magic a secret seems rather selfish, doesn't it? It might actually do some good to be more open with muggles. Maybe not all of them, but... So, Daniel Page wants to make magic with muggles. Contemplating a life of crime, are we? Or are you just looking to see your name in the paper? I'm not a criminal, Cassandra. No? You sound like one. Personally, I find the whole thing ridiculous. Silly muggles, scared of their own shadows. Frightening muggles isn't funny. If you couldn't do magic, you'd be scared too. Let me guess. Mummy is a muggle, isn't she? Shut up! She's not worth it. And I suppose you have something against the non-magical, is that it? Not at all. My uncle is a muggle and he's hilarious. I just have a greater respect for the law, unlike some people. Sounds to me like you don't respect anyone, except yourself. Charming! Ivy. The girl who was late on the first day of school, trying to teach me some sort of lesson? Shut up, Cassandra. You don't know what you're talking about. You just watch yourself, Daniel Page. My father works for the Ministry. One owl from me, and you'll be locked up in Azkaban with all the other criminals. See you in class, Ivy. Oh, unless you're late again, that is. Ignore her, Daniel. <laughs> She's just a bully. I'm fine. Let's go before... Wait. Where's Ivy? Excuse me. Did you see our friend pass by? I saw two friends pass by, although the second did not seem very friendly. In fact, the way she was glaring at the first, I'm not so sure they were friends at all. That doesn't sound good. Which way did they go? Around the corner. Better hurry before someone gets hurt. Hey, Cassandra! Ugh, you again. What is it, Ivy? You didn't really get lost again, did you? I don't care what you say about me, but you should apologize to Daniel. Apologize for what? Telling the truth? <laughs> oh, Ivy, you're not going to fight me over Daniel Page, are you? You should learn to choose your friends more carefully. That boy is no good. Daniel is not a criminal! Ivy, no! Cavanesco! I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. The suit of armor. It's all gone. Vanished. Ivy, did you mean to do that to Cassandra? 
That's crazy. No, I swear. I have no idea what that was. I have no idea why I cast that spell. But that's a powerful spell, Ivy. Where did you even learn it? Did I? I really can't remember. Evanesco is a very advanced spell, especially for a first year student. And you can work on your memory in detention. All three of you. Do we really have to polish every suit of armor in the corridor? Without magic? That's what the professor said. I'm sorry. If I could control my temper, we wouldn't be in this mess. It's my fault. I shouldn't be so sensitive about my family. It's just... she got under my skin. I'm sorry. It's not your fault. Cassandra should be the one apologizing. I don't get it. How can a person be so cruel? I can't believe she hasn't even got detention. She's probably had more experience avoiding punishment. And that's a lesson you'll need to learn. Unless you want to spend all your free time in detention. Yes, Professor Longbottom. And I am sorry about what happened. But I still don't remember where I heard that spell. Heard and practiced, Miss Warrington. Evanesco is not an easy spell to master. Keep thinking on it. And polishing. Good night. You really don't remember, Ivy? No. I just... I just know how to use it. I don't know where I learned it. Or who taught it to me. I'm exhausted. Let's never get in trouble again. Oh, agreed. I solemnly swear that I'll only do good, starting now. Hello, my friends. I have news. The sneaky girl is off sneaking. Sneaking? What girl? What are you on about, Gossamer? That girl who made trouble for you, the blonde one. I kept watch over her to make sure she didn't try to do anything evil ever again. I think he means Cassandra. If she's sneaking around in the middle of the night, that is suspicious. That doesn't mean she's being evil. She might be, I don't know, sleepwalking. Oh no, my friends. She was most certainly wide awake and up to no good. I'm sure of it. I heard her talking to the two boys that looked like one. She clearly mentioned Ivy and Daniel by name and said she knew family secrets that would require investigation and possibly expulsion. Okay, that doesn't sound good. She might be out to get us. Fine, maybe we should see what she's up to. Then it's settled. Where did she go, Gossamer? They're here, all three of them. 
Thanks, Gossamer. You are most welcome. Be careful, my friends. What are they doing? This light? They must be sneaking into the restricted section. I don't think so. It looks like they're in the periodical section. Reading. That's not very devious. Uh, maybe they're just doing homework. No, Cassandra didn't want to be seen. She's up to something. I agree. So, what do we do? I'm not sure. Maybe if we... Wait! One of the twins seems to have left. Spying on us, eh? Cassandra! Look what I found. Daniel Page and his little friends. I'm not surprised. Through with detention already? <gasps> or are you just lost again, hoping to be rescued? You're the one who's going to need rescuing, Cassandra. Breaking into the library after hours? That'll get you detention for sure. It's not breaking in if you have written permission from the head of your house. That doesn't prove anything. And what were you looking for? We couldn't wait until morning. Something you don't want anyone else to see, perhaps. On the contrary, I'd be happy to share. It's just a little local history. Here, I'll give you a clue. How much do you really know about each other? Or about each other's families? What's that supposed to mean? It means some people aren't who they say they are. You don't know anything about my family. Piatantum <laughs> locomotive. What would you know about friendship, Cassandra? I know who I can trust, Daniel Page. Is everyone all right? Nothing a good healing spell can't fix. Stand still, Daniel. Thanks. And thanks for sticking by me. You must think I'm loony for starting a fight over nothing. Cassandra's old talk. She doesn't know anything. Actually, I think she does. About my family. The truth is, most of them are in prison. The poor mother's the blood and the page of That's why I like it here. Nobody knows who I am. It's my secret. This is from a muggle newspaper, isn't it? Yeah, Dad's a muggle. My older brother Reggie, he's a squib. They're both in a muggle prison. It's just me and my older sister now. 
What about your mother? Wait, I do remember something. Is she in Azkaban? How, how could you know that? I don't know. I just remember. I must have read about it. Is it true? Yes. It's true. Mom's old. So when Dad was in Azkaban, she tried to help him. But only ended up scaring a bunch of muggles. She didn't mean to hurt anyone. But the Ministry still accused her of being part of Not Me and sent her to Azkaban. All because it's illegal to perform magic in front of muggles. Stupid law. I'm sorry we can't change the law, but we can keep your secret. We won't tell a soul. We promise. That's right. And if Cassandra thinks she knows something, we'll just have to make sure she forgets it. I might know an advanced memory charm we can use. Thank you. That means a lot. Come on, we'd better get back. If Filch catches us, it'll be detention. Or worse. What about Cassandra? We still never found what she was looking at. Whatever it was, we'll find it later. Come on, let's go. about it. My throat has been so all weak. You two sound terrible. It's not just us. Half the castle seems to be sneezing, coughing, or both. Apparently, Hogwarts is not immune to the common cold. Which is why both of you should be in bed. You'll end up spreading it to others, and then all of us will get sick. What? <coughs> you expect me to skip Quidditch practice? <coughs> You're mental! Easy, Robin. Getting upset won't do your throat any good. Whatever. Just stay away from me, both of you. I've got... to miss class, but Daniel's right. I could use the rest. I hope we didn't upset him too much. He's been a little withdrawn lately, and so busy. I hope he's not trying to avoid us. Ugh. I just want to fly around the castle and not have to stop and catch my breath every two minutes. I hate this. I can't believe I'm saying this. I'm jealous Daniel gets to make his potions all hours of the day. I actually saw him drag a box full of ingredients into the bathroom. He's committed. I'll give him that. Making potions in the bathroom? Hmm. 
Maybe I should look for Daniel in here. Looks like I was right. Daniel is brewing a potion. But what is it? What are you doing here? I was going to ask you the same question. Isn't it obvious? I'm here to make potions. It's the only place in the castle that isn't full of coughing, sneezing, sick people. Is that why you've been avoiding everyone? Not exactly. Look, of course not. Good. Now, since you're here, you can help me. This potion is almost complete, but I need to get some jewelry. Now, just keep an eye on the flame while I'm gone and make sure it doesn't get too hot and boil over. But don't touch it. I'll be right back. What are you on about? What secret? Can you promise, didn't I? Didn't promise not to crack his thieves, don't you dare! I won't let you. I'll patch you up. Fiend fire. Looks like only a little of the potion spilled. Thanks. You're welcome. Now, I think it's time you came clean, Daniel. Who told you that? Peeves? Peeves didn't tell me. You did. I know you care about your friends. Sneaking off to brew a potion... I don't know what you're talking about. This is... Come on, Daniel. It's okay to admit you want to help your friends. I promise I won't tell anyone. Fine. I'm making pepper up potion. But it's because if they feel better, they won't get me... Sure it is, Daniel. By the way, you're blushing. What a crowd. Wait. It, uh, what? Oh, it's... I was just saying hi. Lost? I'm not lost. It's 
my gloves. <sighs> oh, forget it. I have plenty of gloves. What's one less pair? I already told you, however. You could do with the make. Me? I think I'm dressed rather smart today. No, no. This simply won't do. You should wear some personal style? How do I know? It's your style. Think. How do you want the world to see? Fine. I'll help you. It's not that I want to. It's just that I... Uh, okay. to use my magic wardrobe again allow me go ahead please take your time to use my magic wand. Go ahead. Please take your time. to use my magic wardrobe again allow me go ahead please take your time
Lovely, dear. So, what do you think of my new look, Mira? Certainly took your time. Let me see. A gift for you to our new mythic lavender gloves. I just wanted to say thanks, Cassandra. They may not be as nice as... I take back what I said earlier. Apparently... You do have a sense, which still should be checked by professionals. Thanks in advance, Cassandra. But I'll be sure to get your approval the next... What do you think? Shall I wrap these up for you? Here is everything on your list. 